Welcome back to my channel, Technology in the Future. Today, we're diving into an exciting face-off between two powerful handheld gaming devices, the Steam Deck OLED and the new Asus ROG Ally X. We'll compare their performance, battery life, and more to see which one comes out on top. Starting with the Steam Deck OLED, this device features a stunning 90 Hz OLED screen at 7.4 inches. It's highly praised for its comfort during extended gameplay sessions. On the other hand, the ROG Ally X sports a 7-inch 120Hz IPS display. While the OLED screen of the Steam Deck has its fans, the ROG Ally X's ergonomic improvements and display quality are not to be overlooked. When it comes to I.O., the ROG Ally X shines with two USB Type-C ports, one supporting USB 4 and 40 Gb set transfer rates, allowing easy connection to an eGPU. Additionally, it has another USB 3.2 Type-C, a 3.5mm audio jack, a fingerprint power button, and a micro SD card slot. The Steam Deck OLED, though less equipped in this department, still provides essential connectivity options. Under the hood, the Steam Deck OLED boasts a custom AMD APU with four cores and eight threads, clocking up to 3.5 GHz. Its RDNA 2-based iGPU features eight compute units running at 1.6 GHz. Contrastingly, the ROG Ally X is powered by the Ryzen Z1 Extreme, offering eight cores and 16 threads up to 5.1 GHz. It's RDNA 3-based iGPU, with 12 compute units running up to 2.7 GHz, delivers impressive graphical performance. In terms of memory, the Steam Deck OLED comes with 16 GB of LPDR5 RAM at 6400 MHz, while the ROG Ally X is upgraded to 24 GB of LPDR5 X RAM at 7500 MHz. For storage, the Steam Deck offers 512 GB and 1 TB options, utilizing the more expensive 2230 Mi.2 SSDs. The ROG Ally X, on the other hand, is available with a 1 TB SSD, but can be upgraded to 8 TB using the more common 2280 Mi.2 SSDs. Battery life is another critical aspect. The Steam Deck OLED features a 50 watt hour battery with up to 45 watt fast charging, while the Araji Ally X is equipped with a larger 80 watt hour battery that supports up to 100 watts charging. The Steam Deck OLED, being lighter at 640 grams compared to the 678 gram ROG Ally X, offers portability advantages. Pricing is also a deciding factor. The Steam Deck OLED is more affordable, with the 512GB model priced at $549 and the 1TB version at $649. The Raji Ally X starts at $799 for the 1TB model, making it a pricier option but justified by its enhanced features and performance capabilities. Now let's dive into performance testing. We've set the Raji Ally X to a 15 watt TDP to match the Steam Deck OLED for a fair comparison. First up is Shadow of the Tomb Raider at 720p medium settings without fidelity FX. The Raji Ally X outperforms with an average of 57 FPS, while the Steam Deck OLED averages 45 FPS. Next, in Horizon Zero Dawn at 720p medium with FSR set to balanced, the Raji Ally X averages 79 FPS compared to the Steam Deck OLED's 60 FPS. Similarly, Forza Horizon 5 at 720p medium sees the Raji Ally X leading with 64 FPS versus 54 FPS on the Steam Deck OLED. Testing Red Dead Redemption 2 at 720p low settings with FSR balanced, the ROG Ally X shows some stuttering at 15 watt TDP, averaging 53 FPS against the Steam Deck OLED's 51 FPS. However, the Steam Deck OLED's frame pacing is superior, providing a smoother experience overall. Finally, Cyberpunk 2077 at 720p on the Steam Deck preset, FSR balanced, results in the Raji Ally X averaging 46 FPS, while the Steam Deck OLED manages 41 FPS. The Raji Ally X shows a slight edge in minimum FPS as well, though the difference isn't drastic. In terms of battery life, the Steam Deck OLED with its 50 watt hour battery offers impressive longevity. Running Hades 2 at 720p high settings, 50% brightness, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth on, and 60Hz refresh rate, it draws 7.3 watts on average, yielding around 6 hours and 50 minutes of playtime. The RAW G Ally X with similar settings draws 8.2 watts, providing approximately 9 hours and 45 minutes due to its larger 80 watt hours battery. For higher TDP usage, such as Cyberpunk 2077 at 720p with the Steam Deck preset, the Steam Deck OLED draws 23 watts on average, offering about two hours and 10 minutes of runtime. The ROG Ally X drawing 22.1 watts extends this to around three hours and 35 minutes, highlighting its efficiency and larger battery capacity. 
In conclusion, the choice between the Steam Deck OLED and the Raji Alley X boils down to personal preference and budget. The Steam Deck OLED offers a stunning display, excellent support from Valve, and a more affordable price point. Conversely, the ROG Ally X delivers superior performance, extensive I.O. options, and a larger battery, albeit at a higher price. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.